In this video, we will learn how to cast shadows from one volume to another. We need two texture volumes, in this case, clouds and ground fog. We use the texture viewer to see the shadow map. We want to cast shadows from the clouds, so we enable cast shadows in the mesh renderer component of the clouds. A new box is created in the clouds. It is used to project the shadows in the world. Adjust the vertical position and the scale until everything is in contact. In the Lighting tab, we find all the parameters available to tweak the shadow map. We can adjust the refresh ratio to improve performance. The blur effect applied on the shadow map will help us to make it look more natural. This blurred version is shown in the second miniature image. It is also possible to tweak the shadow color. Now let's make our ground fog volume receive this shadow. Notice that both volumes must share the same dimensions and position in the X and Z axis. Select the ground fog and drag the clouds volume to the shadow caster slot. Our ground fog is now receiving the shadows generated by the clouds. With this slider you apply a contrast effect in case you want to make it sharper. That's all!